week's bottom three. Quickly going to start with Randy Jackson. Any thoughts about these folks right now, Randy? I think, you know, it's time for everybody to step up their game. I mean, I think everybody belongs there in my estimation, but Kimberly Carwell. I thought she was actually good last night. Paula, do they deserve to be in the bottom three or not? It's kind of tough. A um, couple, of, couple of performances kind of raised. Actually, only one to me raised her game, and that's Kim. The other two, I think he did a great job, but I do feel you have to be at your greatest point right now. Simon, sorry we're tight on time. Uh, okay, let me just say what I was going to say, because I don't care what you say, Ryan. <laughs> oh, <laughs> anyone else. Most importantly, one person last night proved you can come on this competition, get out the top three, and could win this competition with a great song, and that was Kimberly Locke. This competition is open now to anyone. That's great great about her right I agree. I agree. agree. That's what it's all about. I agree. The people left up there. Excellent. Kim. Well, let me send one of you back to safety. You've all been down here before. I've sent all of you back before. This week, I'm going to send Trinice back to the couches. You are safe, and we'll stick around for another week of American Idol. Congratulations, Trinice. It's now down to Carmen and Kimberly. We just ask you guys, what do you think is going to happen in a couple of minutes? <laughs> Who do you think it's going to be? You want to know, don't you? But you know what they're going to make me do. Absolutely. Just because we have these commercials, and I promise you we're going to do it live next on American Idol. Stay with us. Here we go. Welcome back to American Idol. The results show I can't prolong the agony any longer. The results of the AT&T wireless poll that we did earlier. Proud sponsors AT&T, by the way. We just said vote. We don't know why. Just vote. A. Simon, B. Ryan, or C. SpongeBob SquarePants. I think this is rigged, but Simon got 25% of the vote. I somehow got 41% of the vote, and Spongebob got 34% of the vote. Yeah, yeah, yeah! So I think, I don't yeah. think it's Paula that's drunk, it's our audience. Great, wow. What? All right, gang. One of you stays, one of you packs up and goes home. After the nationwide vote, Carmen, you're safe. Kimberly. We'll be going home tonight. Congratulations, Carmen. Kimberly, we're going to miss Kimberly Caldwell. But you have had a blast, haven't you? This has been so incredible. I don't know if this one works. Thank you so much for this incredible, incredible experience. The judges, thank you so much for all of your constructive criticism most of the time. And um, to these people sitting right over here, all of you are so incredible. I love all of you. You are going to be gigantic stars. Keep dreaming. And you're going to win. Love you all. Thank you, guys. Kimberly Caldwell. And you know what we have? Some highlights, some great moments. It's your trip on American Idol. Take a look. Ever since I was five years old, all I've wanted to do is perform and sing and be in front of an audience. Ever since I did my first song, I knew that that was what I wanted to do for the rest of my life. I don't regret anything that I've ever done because I don't think that I would be the person that I am today. And I thought you did brilliantly. Yeah! I feel like I want somebody to pinch me so I can wake up out of this dream. I have chosen Kimberly. <laughs> All I want to do is go out there and have a great time. When I think back about standing in line in Austin, I would have never imagined that I ever would have got this far. American Idol. It was really cool. It was really, really cool. Like, it's something that I'll always remember. Kimberly Caldwell, America. Kimberly, 
Come up here for a second, sweetheart. Your family is here. They're so proud. And I know you've learned so much on this show. What, what are you going to miss the most about this whole experience on American Idol? Um, <laughs> him screaming, Caldwell, 30 minutes! <laughs> <laughs> Who does that here? Kimberly Locke. <laughs> I was always the last one to get up in the morning, and so I, I had to get ready in like 30 minutes, and she'd always wake me up, Caldwell, 30 minutes! No, I'm going to miss these people. They actually are incredible, incredible roommates, and I love them to death. So I'll be voting for you at home. <laughs> well, congratulations on growing with each week that went by. Kimberly Caldwell, America. I want to remind you, the website, by the way, it's there for you. Let us know what you think about tonight's results. You can head to idleonfox.com. And don't forget, we're going to do another show, an extra show. It's on Monday, halfway home, 8 o'clock, 7 central. Plus, be here for the usual Tuesday and Wednesday fixes. I've been Ryan Seacrest. And to sing you out, it's our final seven one more time. This is out in stores now. Go get it. A portion of the proceeds going to the Red Cross. God bless the USA. Here they are. Start again with just my children and my